We're gonna blow the lid off this thing, guys, all right? He has no idea we're here. We're gonna run in here and uh, take care of this, so. Do you have a light on that thing? Yeah. All right, you fellas ready? Let's go. Wait, 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 wait. Okay, so, um, I know you've asked us here and we're gonna meet you in. Just wanna let you know that there are a few, um, few rules that we have for our services. Oh, okay. Um, we, we do uh, require payment up front, um, $50 a day. Uh, let me, let me look at my pay stuff here for, uh, this week. Um, yeah, it looks like I got paid 2400 this week. Would 2400 cover the week, or? Um, yeah, I mean, I, it should, like I said, $50 an hour, uh, Oh, yeah, up front. Oh, yeah. Okay. Uh, okay. I misspoke. I mean, oh. I, I'm at oh, an hour. Okay. Yeah, nobody would sure. do it for fifty dollars a day. Okay. Well, uh, here, here, here you go. Yeah, but I'm. Yeah, I will need that actually yeah. uh, up front, and we're All gonna right. start right now. Man, so. I, I wish I could make this money in real life. You know what I mean? Yeah, <laughs> I know. Right? Yeah, okay. Oh well, my name is Bradley Oliver. I'm a practitioner of the espionage arts. Uh, I received a, an anonymous tip from one of my sources. Uh, saying that the mayor of the local government was corrupt, so I became vice president of accounting under the mayor to investigate. I did find some irregularities, but I could not find concrete proof. And the last vice president moved away, so I really just brought you guys in uh, to document everything I'm doing so that if I don't make it out of this alive, they'll know why. Hey, bud, um, we're going to go ahead and have to need that uh, $50. Oh, yeah. Hang on. There you go. Thanks. We're going to the dead drop so I can find the location and time that we're going to meet my informant. It's in a waste disposal unit, portable, which is right there. Hold my jacket. I got it! I got it! We can now figure out where to make it to meet my informant. <sighs> Looks like we're going to the big anchor in an hour. Are you guys going to be okay? Y yeah. We're headed to uh, the waterfront by the big anchor. Uh, we're supposed to meet my informant in about an, about an hour. Are, are we being followed? Oh, oh! Hey, where are you going? Is that a, is that a turtle? Oh. Yeah, in, in, in about. Alright guys, I need you both to stay right here. I'm gonna go down, talk to my informant, see what information he wants to give me, okay? And I'll be uh, I'll be right back, so you don't even don't even film because it's it's gonna be just go ahead and put it down, okay? Hand me that zoom lens. Yeah, did you see him wipe his head with his hand? Yeah, that guy's insane, man. He is. My word, that is an extravagant marshmallow suit you have there. May I ask, were you able to acquire my information? Yeah, I got your information right here, but it's gonna cost you oh? 10 pounds of jujubes. The other workers at the Wonka factory won't let me have them because they think it makes my blood glucose level too high. Uh, hold on, my wife's calling. Cow. Oh my god, he used the blue hand. Are you ready? Yeah. Okay. So. Um, oh, yeah, I need to go ahead and get that $50. Oh. Okay. Yeah. Uh, we're at the mayor's office, and we're going to use the key to go in through the door. I got the card. So. Uh, I would uh, like to make a suggestion. What? Swipe the card.
Get that door. I, I can't crack this password. <laughs> try Balky. Balky? Yeah, try Balky. All right, we got it. Let's go. So, uh, we just got a call from Mr. Oliver. Came up with some valuable information. Uh, we're on our way over to his house to document it. Document it. <laughs> Alright. So we're on our way. <laughs> Are we filming? Yeah. Uh, yeah. yeah. Okay. You see these numbers here? Uh, these small ones here? Do you know what they mean? No. Okay. Well, these numbers um, here... Uh, I, just, I hate to... Stop. Mm -hmm. We're gonna we're gonna need that fifty box. Oh. Uh, sorry. Sorry, sorry uh, about that. I, yeah, I keep just... forgetting. Yeah. Thank you. Okay. These small numbers. These coincide with uh, dates in the ledger, where the mayor made payments to a place called Miller Boyette. Um, but the numbers don't match what's in our ledgers. So I checked them against my discrepancies, and the difference between these. And what's in the ledger is the same as the discrepancy. So this definitively proves that there is misappropriations going on. And I think that we need to go confront him. And so that's what we'll do. Uh, won't that be dangerous? The life of a spy is always dangerous. Yeah, we're going to have to uh, renegotiate our feet. We're going to blow the lid off this thing, guys, all right? He has no idea we're here. We're going to run in here and uh, take care of this. So, Do you have a light on that thing? Yeah. All right, fellas, ready? Let's go. Wait, 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 wait. We're gonna need that money. Hang on, let me. I don't know if I've got any cash in here. I don't. I don't have any. I don't have any cash. Will you take a check? Uh, yeah, yeah, I guess. Whatever. doing here squirt we figured out that you've been embezzling money and i have proof you know nothing i have the ledger who is miller boyette and why have you been paying them money miller boyette is the creator of the most perfect series of all time perfect strangers and you're right i've been embezzling taxpayer dollars so i can bribe miller boyette to digitally remaster the series and put it on dvd for my personal reasons because because of balky is my myposian angel Standing tall on the leaves of a tree. <laughs> All right, yeah, I turned in the ledger to the police, and they're going to go pick up the mayor, hopefully. Uh, I can't stick around to find out. I've got to go on to the next case. i got some new information, and I can't wait to get started on the next one. i got to quit my accounting job, though. Don't need that money, son. Oh. Hold on, it's my wife. Cal.